Hi, welcome back to the Stitch and Post. It's our Thursday demos. I'm Annette, and I'm going to be showing you this cool little gadget from the Gypsy Quilter. It is for cleaning your wool mats. So if you've seen your wool mats getting a little lifeless and some dirt, um, dirt spots, the spots actually are not burnt. They're actually from you using starch is what mine on mine at home is all about. And then threads get ground in, but this little handy tool, it's all metal. The head is four and a half inches wide by three eighths of an inch thick. And it's got a metal handle with um, a no slip grip on it. So as you can see, see here, I slip, I don't slip there. So it's really handy and it is rubber. And all you do, and you can move it both directions. You just pull it and push and it brings up all the grime that's on your mat. And you just keep working your way through and even the spots will come off. You don't want to work in one spot too long because you could make a little divot and you don't want that on your mat. So just, see, that spot's almost gone. But just work your way across and back and all the threads come up. And it looks like we got a little bit of paint on this one. So we're gonna see if we can work this paint. See, there's a little bit there and a spot there. So we're gonna see if we can work those guys off so it doesn't go on to anybody's project that uses this mat next. We, we keep mats in our classroom and we also put them in our Quilters Affair classrooms. So I'm sure somebody from our Quilters Affair staff is going to have to at least look at the mats from last year to see if they need to be cleaned before this year's show, before this year's classes start. So that's all you do to clean your mats with our little handy kids jimbo. And we have all kinds of mats in stock and we have them and you can even use it on your little one from if you're a um, hand person and you work with wool with Sue Spargo stuff or anybody else and you just use it, just make sure you keep your fingers. You might wanna use a stiletto to hold it instead of using your fingers. So have a nice day, see you next week.